Yo, it's your DJ here giving a tutorial on how to use Brute Force save data. Basically, what Brute Force is, it's just a save editor for your PlayStation 3. You can do different kinds of modifications. But anyways, um, when you open the RAR file that's in the description, um, there's going to be a couple files. Make sure these last two files are installed. And if not, it, they're going to give you errors on the actual program. Since I already have it pre-installed, just for this video or whatever, I'm going to install the actual program. So let it install for whatever time. Finish. It's going to load up a bunch of cheats or whatever. You could uncheck it if you want. Uh, I guess for this purpose, I'll just download it. I'll just download the cheats from their servers or whatever. So once it's done downloading, just click OK. Um, it's going to open global settings. Don't worry about that. Well, it, I'll teach you how to do that stuff later. It's going to say uh, program. Um, it's going to say uh, find an SFO file. So once you find the SFO, just have it linked into your USB. Make sure that your USB is formatted to FAT32. You're going to see, just let me load the, the thing. Properties. Make sure it's FAT32. If it's not, the your PlayStation 3 isn't going to read it. So make sure it's formatted that way. So I'm going to load the save from my USB. So I just click on that. Uh, just load on the second one, I guess. Or the first. FM, whatever, just put, I don't know. There, just put nigger, for example, right? So let me check out the icons. Refresh. Hello. Oh, it's stupid. Okay, my bad. Go to keys, hold on. Let me go to my USB again and do this again. There you go. Now we see it. Okay. So right here, I'll explain, I'll explain what this dashboard is basically. Alright, right here, this is the profile that I'm on. This is my right here, this is the empty profile. And this is the profile that's linked to my PlayStation account. So there's two different saves, but they're the same game, right? Don't worry about this. I'll teach you how to modify that stuff later. This is the hash key, the disk hash key. Without this, you won't be able to modify the saves, decrypt or encrypt or anything. You can't touch it. You basically can't touch it. You need this to unlock your um, your saves. But most games have it, and your your program should have your brute force should have it. If not, I'm pretty sure there's a source out there. But anyways, um, right here in the power frames, this is an empty account, so it's not linked into anything. This is my PlayStation account, so it shows my profile uh, ID, and this is my console ID right here. So if you get banned or whatever, you gotta change that ID. Let me just let me show you a full. What this looks like. Yeah, and it'll say user number. What is it? Zero zero two. So what we're gonna do is um, we're gonna make this um, this save right here. Actually, we're gonna delete. We're actually, we're, we're, you'll see what I'm gonna do with this. So what we're gonna do is, um, we're gonna decrypt the file, right? Decrypt, decrypt all files. Yes. Right. And then um, we're gonna apply some cheats, some basic cheats or whatever, right? So what we're gonna do, let's add in the basics. Max HP. A. Fuck it, just, just level 100. Make it very simple. Apply the cheats. Two cheats are applied. You can do whatever you want after that. Um, another thing is that's nice is that you could change in the region. So I'm gonna change in the region by going to title change region. And let's say you don't know what your region is for whatever game. You can actually look at the side of the case and it'll display the the, the region code for you. So in this case, uh, we're gonna we're gonna make it to English. So B O B O U S three and there you go. Now we already converted, um, but we're not done yet. Since this is on the 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 nigger account, we're gonna we're gonna set profile right. Set profile configure 
and we're gonna go with what what is this on? B O U S. Okay, so we're gonna go in here. Yes. And there you go. It'll be used for patches or whatever. So after that, we're gonna e encrypt the file. Encrypt the encrypted files. Yes. All right, we're good. Uh, we're not. We're not done yet. We're not done yet. So what, what we're gonna do right now is um, verify the PFD. It's good to go. Rebuild just in case. There. There. Right there. After 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 you verify the PFD, it'll tell you if it's good or not. And then after that, you rebuild and it'll link into this. So we're gonna move on to the PlayStation. All right, since we're already in the PS3, uh, make sure you go to Save Data Utility because that's where all your saves are at. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna copy, copy. It's gonna go paste. It appears in Japanese, but don't worry about it. You'll see exactly what I'm gonna do later. Let me just. All right. So since we occurred, converted my Japanese save into this, you're gonna see how it works. See how it shows like Japanese or whatever. Don't worry about that. So we're gonna go access the game. And there you go. The saved worked. The saved worked. I'm at level 100 with stuff. The stuff that don't matter. And there you go, see? And um, that's basically the tutorial.